Let's um, let's leave yeah. that there because now we're into the detail, and there were some headlines given uh, a moment ago. Words like the consequences were underestimated, inadequate, um, and so there. It's it's not the whitewash you were talking about. This is this looks like there is certainly the beginning of the inquiry you wanted. Yes, I think this is. My thoughts immediately have gone to the families of the deceased soldiers that lost their lives, and I hope that this is actually going to give them some of the answers that they're looking for. Um, I hope that it doesn't then turn out to be a bit wishy-washy, and I hope that those headlines really, really are, are the start of something good. Military action before peaceful actions were exhausted. Absolutely damning. So, you're saying Tony Blair jumped the gun and that he didn't allow the weapons inspection, uh, inspectors to continue their work. We know Hans Blix, who was the, the chief inspector mm. for the UN at the time, wanted longer. No weapons of mass destruction were found at the end of the day. That is very damning for Tony and Blair. And the consequences were underestimated. No, absolutely. The planning for afterwards, what happens, knocking over Saddam Hussein was the easy part. What you did in Iraq afterwards was much harder and there was no proper planning. And quickly, those soldiers who were seen initially as liberators yeah. were viewed as occupiers and became targets for, uh, for Iraqis. And also, Hannah, just when we were watching that, I was watching you closely and seeing very emotional in your eyes. This has been a long time coming to wait to hear this. You probably feared this morning, like you said, could have been a whitewash. Is there some relief to hear those words? Yes, there is, because I think that um, all, all soldiers um, and the families of those soldiers that lost their lives have been waiting to hear, you know, why it happened, mm. how it happened, and it sounds like we are finally going to get some yeah. answers. Mm. Well, that was the beginning. Good. That was the headlines. We wanted to bring those to you. Um, obviously, this is a, 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 going to be quite a, a long press conference here. There's a lot yeah. to be said. We don't know um, w what will be the final mm. conclusion. Um, uh, and hopefully there'll be, a, there'll be a lot of people who've been locked in since 8 o'clock this morning mm. yeah. who will have read through not that full 2.7 million mm. worded uh, report, but there was a, a preceded version, about yeah. 130 pages yeah. preceded version. So uh, hopefully we'll uh, we'll get to get to that very soon. But for the moment, thank you thank very you. much indeed.